everybody welcome to my channel my name is Janae if you're new if you're not what's up today I'll show you guys how I got this bantu knot twist braid beaded all over the place style I was trying to do like it was gonna be all bantu knots with just like the braids in the front but then the back like it wasn't working out like bantu knots are just like not my forte so doing the back it just wasn't working out so I just ended up doing the twist instead I love doing like different stuff like where it's just like I haven't really seen anybody do it or if they have done it I haven't seen them do it in a while and this is exactly what I love just like randomness it's kind of like uneven but we just gonna ignore that <laughs> but yeah so if you want to see how I got this look go ahead and keep on watching all right I look all like crusty and shiny because I just like woke up but I'm gonna even get this out the way because I got stuff to do today. So I washed my hair last night and then I let it air dry overnight and then I blew it out this morning because I do not like blow drying my hair. I'm sucking my hair and plus it was like late as hell last night. So this is what my hair looking like. Usually, well not usually because I've never done this before, but <laughs> like I would have, this look crooked. I would have been using my, uh, my shine jam to do the style but it's like empty <laughs> and I was trying to save money I didn't want to go to the store and buy a new jar because even these small jars I think this jar was like five dollars and the bigger jar is like seven dollars or I don't know but I didn't want to spend no money so I'm trying to think I think I'm just going to use my eco or actually my gorilla's knot is somewhere else I think I'm gonna use my gorilla's knot because my eco my hair is going to revert. My hair is going to revert either either way, but I think the Gorilla Snot will give me a stronger hold, so let me go get that. Okay, got my Gorilla Snot, and this is probably going to make my hair revert too, but not as bad. So, I'm going to start by sectioning my little braids off. I always do my little braids, no matter like what style I do, because I think it just looks really cute. Not too much. And don't mind my nails. Like, I know they're broken, <laughs> but they're just some press-ons that I made. Stay tuned. I'll be launching my own press-on line very soon. But, yeah, they're just some press-ons that I made. I wasn't expecting to keep them on, so I didn't, like, try to glue them on that strong. I thought I was going to take these off and do another set, but I'm like, I'm not going to have time to do that. So, I'm just going to keep these on. So, I have to re-glue them because I didn't glue them down very good the first time but yeah hopefully I can be dropping my press-ons very very soon I wanted to start next week but don't know if that's gonna work out but yeah for sure in the next couple weeks I hope to uh I hope to be dropping my press-ons I'm starting with the front just because I can see the front and it doesn't make sense to start with the back and then like I end up with short little weird pieces in the front. So I'm just gonna start with the front. Where did I put my comb? Pretty sure I took my comb in the bathroom. Oh well. I was gonna do triangle parts, but I really don't know how to do that. <laughs> and I don't got the patience to sit here and try to figure it out. So we're just gonna do square parts.
I think I'm gonna put I would usually do five but since I have these I might do four but I don't want to do it in the middle I might put five Mm. Not think before. Yeah. I don't think I'm be able to put uh, I don't think I'm be able to fit five. I feel like I like this better if there was five. Like I love when there's five in the front, but I'm not finna take this down. <laughs> like, I don't got the patience to redo this. It's just gonna have to be four. I think I'm just gonna put one in the middle right here. To like, cause this is weird. It's just like a space, so there's like one in the middle right here. I think that should be fine. try to break these parts down now so I don't have to do them later. I'm gonna use my shining gem for this part because the grill snow will be too slippery and I can't braid my hair with my nails especially when it's super slippery. Okay, I did the two front braids. I'm trying to decide if I want to add beads or not, but I'm going to figure that out. At the end, I'll go ahead and do one more row. And then I got to go in the bathroom because I need a bigger mirror. Like, just looking at my phone is, like, complicated. The 
parting that took way too long and I'm not gonna do it again so <laughs> I'm only gonna have like three rolls in my head let me fix this one Okay, so I finished the middle part and then I was gonna do four of them in the back but then honestly I was being lazy and it's like it was not working out like I did the first one the second one just wasn't trying to like stay so I'm just like you know what we're just not gonna do that so I have these two rows of bantu knots and then I have four braids in the back and two braids in front and I'm gonna put beads on all of these braids but first I think I'm gonna tie my hair down and then I'm gonna put the beads on so I'm just taking a little bit of my um, Cheyenne Jam, try to lay this down since it's like not as tight as it probably should be. It's like, it needs to be slicked down a lot more. I'm gonna also spray the Bantu knots with some Gossipy spray just so they like stay where they're supposed to be. beads on usually since my hair is orange I would use my brown beads but I ran out so I'm gonna use these they're like white and clear I think I'm gonna use the let me use the clear ones I don't have a beater because I lost it, <laughs> so I just use a bobby pin.
So I'm gonna go ahead and finish putting the beads on the rest of them because it's kind of like pointless to watch, but yeah. Okay, and this is the finished look. This wasn't quite what I had in my head, but I still kind of like it. Like my Bantu knots are kind of like weird, but like this is like my only, I keep saying like, I need to stop. This is only probably my second time ever really doing Bantu knots and I kind of suck at it, obviously, but I don't know. I wish I had my shine gem so I could have made this like slicker, but it's really not that bad. It really isn't as like not slick as it looks. It's just the way my hair grows in because of the orange hair when it grows in and like my roots come in, it just looks like messy, but it's really not. It's actually pretty slick down. It just, it's just the color makes it look super messy. But then I have the braids going to the front with the beads, the four braids in the back with the other beads. I have no idea what the back looks like, so if it look a mess, just ignore it. I think these are too big. They're like taking away from the look. Let me change these. yeah that's much better all right so this is the end of the video if you like the way this turned out uh go ahead and give me a like don't forget to like share subscribe comment all that all right see you next one bye